Chess friends, welcome to our today's genius chess course video, in this video I will show you one of the most beautiful chess game of Alpha Zero and Stockfish, today Alpha have white pieces and when computer get white pieces he gain advantages of first move, that means he have opportunity to attack me first, but I am the father of chess, let's see who is the father of whom, Alpha started with d4, we have knight f6, bishop f4 which is called London system. Alpha want to make this game draw because he afraid of me, so d6, knight here, bishop here and d3, we have knight to d7, here you can play c5, or knight to h5 to grab the bishop, so h3, c6, it is my book move, so I have to play this, now my tactic is to bring the queen out to attack on this pawn, and I can play e5 to gain center advantages, c3, queen c7, alpha move back his bishop on h2, his plan is to push the g-pawn then knight here to target the bishop, I strike the center with e5, bishop here, e4. I closed the position, knight backs, queen b6, to target this innocent guy, so queen up to b3, two queens seeing each other to compare who is more beautiful, you cannot take the queen, let me show you, if queen takes queen happen, then after pawn takes, you no need to worry about this double pawns, because the rook gets the afile to use it, by sitting on his home garden chair, these aren't just double pawns, these are triple bondage true friends, next move is knight here to target this pawn. White will be better in this position, so, back to the position, I played bishop e7, same as white, he cannot take the queen because of the same tricky situation as black faced last move, also, I have d5 move, to make a strong pawn chain and structure, so alpha played c4, castle, knight here, rook to c8, queen back to c2, in this position, if you play any useless move, for example, if you think rook b8 because of your useless brain, then alpha will play g4 because he is a stockfish subscriber, bishop x and g5. You have to move back your knight, then h4, and that's it, put your bishop on g4 to prepare for h5, White will gain bigger space on kingside and dominance in light square, so, back to the position, we have d5, c5, queen retreats on d8, I am preparing b6 to break the structure, we have castle, rather than declare war on kingside alpha make a safe place for the king, queen here, b4, bishop backs, bishop d6 to target this, I could play bishop here but I choose to play queen to e8, rook b1, here, takes, and rook takes, we have b5, you shouldn't take the pawn because the knight will activate on there to disturb the rook and looking for the outpost, so I played a5, rook to b3, alpha's idea is to make a triple rook batteries with the queen to lightning the b-file, so, queen b7, rook here, slides, queen comes battery is ready, now clear the b-file by exchanging the pawns, then play rook b7 to get the 7th rank and so on, queen on f8, knight back to f1, in this position. If you play again a useless move queen to g8, then knight a4, queen here, queen c3, just play one more useless move, then takes, takes knight here, takes, takes, the pawn is getting close to his destination and at the same time he is targeting on this rook, if rook blocks then rook here, to target this pawn with two pieces, so if you try to counter my pawn by playing queen b1, saying you go for my pawn, then I will go for your pawn, no, inferior human, there is rook takes pawn, rook takes, and rook takes b6. You are trapped, queen cannot take it because of this, and at the same time rook cannot take it because you will lose your queen, and chess friends, if you want to be strong at chess then like and subscribe to my youtube channel to get more episodes, back to the position, we have bishop e6, knight here, I played h5, let me show you my strategy, if you play 1600 elo move rook c1, then h4, another useless move, then g5, rook here, g4, this rook move gives a big amount of certain advantages, after some best moves. Rook here and rook b1, I will take the pawn, if you take it, then it will be worst situation, there is bishop takes, queen will come to seize the g-file, also, I have the rook to support the queen behind from him to checkmate white, there is 17 moves checkmate, so, back to the position, here we have queen c3, h4, my plan is clear, just push the kingside pawns to open the position, 
and white cannot defense his kingside with his queenside pieces because the center position is closed, so after pawn takes, takes. We have knight b6, knight cannot take it, I already told you why, because the b pawn will be passed, and it will create some troubles for black, and the c6 pawn will be weak, the a5 pawn can be a target by the rook and queen, so here, we have rook a7, rook here to target this a pawn, we have knight back to g8, I want to play knight here, then push the kingside pawns as well, rook takes, knight f6, queen b4, g5, threatening to play g4, knight backs, g4, takes, takes, takes and takes, this is well, we have rook takes. Rook takes a7, alpha moved back his knight, his next plan is to play queen b6 to target the rook, if the rook moves on, then just push the pawn to create problems for black, so king here, a4, we have knight here, queen here, Wish you all the best, thanks for watching subscribe for more bye bye take care see you soon.